and I almost forgot. Hi everyone, welcome back or welcome if you are new. Today I want to show you all my Harry Potter car accessory must-haves. All right, let's get into the video. All right, before we get started, I want to talk about the items that I recently purchased off of Amazon, and then I'm going to take the camera outside and show you all the other Harry Potter features that I have in my car. All right, for item number one, it's going to be a car accessory for the exterior of your car. We have this wiper tag. So this is the elder one. So you can see the details here, and it's kind of on this little like plastic it's pretty flimsy thin piece if you have a rear windshield wiper you can just attach that to the back and then it will wipe it like so <laughs> it's gonna be so cute so it came in this packaging they have a bunch of different accessories that you can attach onto the back of your window and this is how you attach it so here it comes with some adhesive you can attach to it to get it to stick to the back of your windshield wiper and it also says down here that you can use some zip ties for some extra security if, if this isn't working, but those are not included, but the adhesive is included inside, so that's cool. So we'll go outside and attach it to the car. The next recent purchase I bought off of Amazon is this steering wheel cover, and let me take it out of this packaging real quick. All right, so this is the steering wheel cover out of the packaging. It is pretty small. I thought it was gonna be a little bigger, but I guess it just, it's just gonna go right around the steering wheel, and it has the little Hogwarts logo on here. Let me see one that you can see. It's upside down. <laughs> All right, so this is what the logo looks like. And then we'll add that to my steering wheel cover to make it a little more fancy. My next recent purchase is something I actually got off of Etsy, and it's this sticker. I'm not sure how much you're going to be able to see. I think I might have it upside down. <laughs> I think this is it, right? So you'll be able to see it a little better once I attach it to my car. It's the <laughs> Weasley's car, and it says, get in, loser. We're going to Hogwarts. So it's a little Mean Girls quote meets Harry Potter. So I think that is so adorable. So we will add that to my car window. And then my final recent purchase is going to be this car diffuser. So this car diffuser comes with a really cute attachment and some essential oils. So it has this little Deathly Hallows car freshener where you would attach a little pad inside here and then you add your little droplets to add the scent. So in here, it comes with four different essential oils. That's just the packaging, ignore that. <laughs> so let's see what scents it comes with. So this one is Inner Calm. Don't know what that smells like. It says it's a unique blend of orange clove, lavender, and patchouli. So that's the first one. So this one is a peppermint oil. The next one is the scent Zen. So let's see what the notes are for this one. A unique blend of clove leaf, orange, patchouli, and anise star. I don't know how to say those. <laughs> Let me see if I can show you. Those are the scents for this one. And then the last but not least, We've got a lavender one. It also comes with these little pads and you have a bunch of different colors and those colors will actually show through here. So let's take them out. What color should we do? Red for Gryffindor, I guess. <laughs> so it's going to open up here. So then you just place this little pad inside and you're going to shut it like so. This magnetizes and then that's how you can see the red through it. So super cute and then you just attach this to one of your car vents so then the air will just push the scent throughout the car so that is going to be so cute i love how little it is so i can't wait to put that in my car and enjoy some of the scents i wonder what scent we should use i think i'll use zen so we'll take this one with us to the car and we'll bring those and everything else so now i will meet you outside and we'll check out the rest of my car accessories all right we're outside and it's pretty windy but we have the attachments that i need to add to the back of the car all right so we're on the back of the car and we need to add these attachments so let's go ahead and do that i will flip the camera over so you can see it oh and before i attach it i want to show you the other things that i have that's harry potter on my car so i have this sticker here that i got off of amazon it's on the back driver's side window and it looks so cute. It goes really well since it's white and my car is white. And then another little thing that I have on the back of my car, right under the car's logo is this little magnet. And it says, I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. <laughs> so I have that on here. And then let's go to the other side. Okay, and then on the other side, I have the Deathly Hallows emblem. It's like a metal piece on here. I think it looks really good next to this EX 
on here. It kind of looks like it came with the car, but it didn't. It's like a sticker almost, and it just attached really easily on the back of my car here. So let's go ahead and add that windshield wiper and see how easy it is to attach. <laughs> All right, so I added the little adhesives on the back of this, and they're kind of like these little Velcro pieces, actually. I thought they were gonna be a little more like command strips, but let's see how this attaches. So, if you can see that here, I want it to be like the length of it. So meet the same tip. So I'll put it here and then I'll push it back on here. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Look at that. <laughs> and I've got the elder one on the back of my car now. That is so adorable. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. That was so easy. I don't think it's gonna go anywhere either. Like it is attached. Cool. So that was item one that I need to add on. All right, the next one is a sticker. So I don't know exactly where I should put it. I, I think I wanna put it on this side, but I don't know if I should put it down here or up here since it's like a flying car. So what do you guys think? Down here, up here. All right, so I decided on this top left placement and I just need to push in everything. So I took the back off and I just attached it here, but you just kind of have to work your way through each piece of the sticker. So that way when you remove this top of it, it doesn't take any of the letters or any of the details from it. So I will work through this and then I will peel it off. All right, I think I'm ready to peel this off now. I hope I didn't miss anything. Looking good, oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, you see that? <gasps> okay, okay. Let's go, um, what do I do? Oh no, I didn't notice that was happening. Right. Not a huge deal. I will just try to place it after I just do the whole thing. I just gotta commit, I think. Oh no. Okay, we got that off. All right, now we need to put the hood top of the car back on. Oh no. Oh no. Can't believe I did that. Okay, okay, we can fix this. Stay calm. Oh no, this is not looking good. Well, nobody's gonna know. Oh gosh. Kinda ruined it, didn't I? Uh, that's a shame. Well, I think it's fine. It's best I can do. <laughs> All right, so that is the back of the car sticker. So it says, get in losers, we're going shop. No, we're not going shopping. So it says, get in losers, we're going to Hogwarts. All right, and then this is another feature I have on the back of my car. So this says, Ministry of Magic, authorized muggle vehicle. So I'm trying to block out my license plate number, but you get the gist. And then just in case you are interested, this is what the whole outside of my car looks like. I think she's super cute. I've had her for about a year now. She's a 2021 Kia Seltos EX. And I just love my little features I have added to her. And I know it's super windy, so I hope it's not picking up too bad on this video. So I apologize for that. But that's just a little overview of my car. All right, now we're inside the car and I have just a couple things to show you inside. I think I only have, what, one, two, two things, three things to show you. So first, I might as well show you my keys. So I have this little Harry on my keys in here. So I just have the key and then I have this little Harry keychain. He's so cute. I got this from the Wizarding World at Universal in Orlando. And I also have this little baby charm on here, a little Gryffindor one. I got off of a different keychain, but I kept this little piece here. I think it's just so cute. That's just another little accessory I have in my car. All right, next is gonna be this car freshener. So we have to attach it to one of my car vents. So let me grab the camera and I will flip it around to show you where I'm going to put it. All right, now that I have the camera flipped around, this is the front dash of my car. All right, so I'm gonna attach it to this side of the vent and it's nice and snug like so. That is so cute. Look at that. 
So that is the car freshener. And like I was showing you before, the little insert inside, you can change it out so you can put whatever color preference you want in there. It, it came with a bunch of different ones. And I just have the red, you know, represents some Gryffindor. <laughs> um, but that is that. And then the only thing you have to do is drop one to three drops onto the little pad with the essential oil. I think that that is plenty. I mean, you can kind of adjust it as you go. Maybe start with just one and then add more as you see fit. That way you're not super overwhelmed with whatever scent you pick. And of course you can use other essential oils. They sell this by itself if you have your own oils. So I'm really happy with this purchase. And I love the little detail that it adds to the inside of my car. All right, next I have some car coasters that I want to show you. So I got these off of an Etsy shop. I have two of them to go in my cup holders. And they have just like these really cute little Harry Potter icons throughout it. Some Holocruxes. There's like a platform 93 quarters ticket. There's the time turner. There's wands. There's all kinds of stuff. So I have these for two reasons. So one is to keep my car a little cleaner. So just in case you are handed a drink or something and there's a little bit of runoff or the condensation, they'll help me keep the inside of that cup holder cleaner. And then also the second reason is because it's just another little pop of Harry Potter that I can add to my car or just another little accessory to make it a little bit cuter inside. So that's why I like to have these and on the back of these ones they are just like that cork material very common that you will see in coasters and I'll just grab the camera so I can show you what it looks like inside the cup holders all right so here are my cup holders so you just pop them right inside like so and I like that it has those little indents on there it makes it easier when you need to pop them out so you can grab them out just like so and then you just pop them right back in and then look how cute that looks. They're just so simple and just a nice little touch. And I don't find them to be cluttery or anything like that. I don't like a whole lot of stuff in my car, as you can see. I just have like this little cup area that I, ha I keep my sunglasses in. There's a phone charger and then that's where I drop my keys usually. And this is kind of what my car looks like all the time. I mean, down here I have some extra gym shoes so I'm not like the cleanest person but I try not to keep a whole lot of stuff in my car. I also have an umbrella over here and then on this side I have a cute little trash can. This is also purchased from Amazon and I love that I have this in my car. I showed this in a video earlier in my channel but I just want to show it off here. It's just so cute. You just pop this open and you can throw your trash in there. It's great for like if you have straw wrappers or things like that or what I'm disposing of like a mask or something. I just pop them in there. Super simple and I just have those few little accessories. Nothing too much. And of course I listen to my Harry Potter audiobook <laughs> while I'm in my car. And I almost forgot about my car steering wheel cover that I just purchased off of Amazon. So let's go ahead and add that to here and see what it looks like. Just pulling that right over <laughs> and it fits pretty snug. That's good. All right, let me show you guys. All right, so I have it on here like so. So here are the details of the crest. I am gonna to be totally honest with you guys. I don't know if I love it. It just wasn't really what I was expecting when I ordered this, but I don't love this like elastic band because my hand definitely is going to rest on it. Like if I'm holding it like this, it's not that comfortable. Um, this part is, but I just don't like this part. And I don't really love that you can't really see what is on the steering wheel cover. It's pretty cut off, so I'm just not a huge fan of it. I might keep it for a little bit, but we'll see. But that is going to be the new steering wheel cover. Also a little bonus item. This one is on my husband's car, and it's a front license plate that says Mischief Manage. So that is super cute. I wish my car had a place for a front license plate, but it does not. So he gets to enjoy that. See, this is the front of my car, so there's no place for it. But I think it looks really good on his black truck, and it's just a nice little Harry Potter detail. All right, so that's gonna conclude today's Harry Potter car accessory must-haves. If you had a favorite item, please leave it down in the comments below. And if you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up. 
Don't forget to subscribe, turn on your bell notifications so you're notified during my next video upload, and thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day.